Hi guys, so for those of you who don't know, I live in Miami. We are getting prepared for the Hurricane Irma. And when they say it's category three, it's like get ready. But when they say it's category four or five, it's alarming. And basically it means just be prepared, get ready. Hopefully we'll not go past category five because that would be catastrophic. So in this video, I'm just getting ready to head out and see what else I can find. Um, a lot of the stores are closing today, tomorrow, and a lot of stores don't have a lot left. So I'm hoping to see if I can get a few more things that I need. And basically this is a makeup, like a simple makeup that doesn't take me long with cruelty-free brands and trying to use natural products. So without talking anymore, let's begin. So today's Thursday, September 7th, and this is how I look without makeup. This is my bare face, my natural hair. And basically, I didn't work today. I don't work tomorrow. Kids don't have school. And I didn't work Monday either. It was Labor Day, so I only got to work Tuesday and Wednesday. And basically, today has been such a nice day. It's been sunny. A little bit windy but nothing major and just yesterday I heard in the news that 90% of Bermuda Island is destroyed all the homes the buildings is a wreck and you know it's alarming when they say it's category 5 and we're just getting ready and basically I just have all the food items um, so far we are thinking about staying home um, but who knows? So I'm just gonna start getting ready for some errands that I need to do today. So I'm gonna start with my rose water and a lot of these things you have seen that I have shared before but these are the things that I normally use and I try to use things that are natural. This smells wonderful and I like to apply it on my face and hair. And what I'm doing, I'm just cleaning my face like if this was a toner and honestly i feel a little tense other years it doesn't affect me i stay calm but for some reason this time I feel a little bit nervous and yesterday I had a little bit of pain in my stomach and I know that I get like that when I am nervous about something um, so I'm just trying to keep myself busy and think about other things then I apply vitamin C and this basically helps to eliminate spots and prevent wrinkles And then I just massage this onto my skin. The only thing is that when you use vitamin C, you have to moisturize your skin. If not, the vitamin C dries your skin. I'm going to apply this. And I already filled up my car with gas. I did it two days ago and I didn't have to wait. But if you go during these days, oh my goodness, a lot of gas stations don't have gas. And if they have, the lines are long. So to moisturize my skin, I'm gonna use this one by Osea. So I just apply a few dots on my skin. And as you can see, I'm already running out of this one. And this helps to moisturize and prevent blemishes. And it feels like a fresh sensation, like mint. And it feels really good. <laughs> so now I'm going to use 100% base. It's one of the most natural brands that I have used and it has fruit pigments and it's really great for your skin so this is how I apply it I just press the pump and then I just kind of let it fall on my skin 
and whatever I have left over on the little wand I apply it on the other areas of my skin and with a beauty blender I'm just gonna apply that onto my skin so I brought a mirror to be able to see better what I'm doing so we have been home I already have food items and now with Lavera cover stick I'm gonna apply this on my spots and under my eyes a little bit here where I have some spots I actually shared this in my last favorites video and I mentioned why I like it so much so let's blend that in so the hurricane is expected to be here by Saturday or Sunday so let's hope that nothing major happens so now I'm gonna apply face powder by Milani so lately I have been watching a lot of documentaries on Princess Diana so I just knew the basics what everyone knows but I've been learning so much about her personal life and how she struggled with Prince Charles and everything that she went through and she always seemed happy she was always smiling but in reality deep inside she was suffering so much this is a blush that i recently bought and it's by the brand pacifica and i like that it's between like a bronzy color and like a dark pink and she was so honest and she was so open about her personal life something that people around her didn't want her to do so basically that's it for my face today i just want something simple something basic as an everyday use so now i'm going to continue with lips what i have been using for my lips is this one that has coconut oil and this is just to hydrate my lips and lately i have felt my lips to be dry and even my eyes so i've been drinking a lot of water and I'm going to eat more fruits. This is by Lush and this is Latte. I believe they don't make this one anymore but I really like it because it's like a bronzy color. I like bronze earth tone colors. It gives a little bit of shyness and as a lipstick I have this one by e.l.f. which is party in pink and I really like this one a lot. And that's all for my lips, so now I'm going to continue with my eyes. And by the way, I have been really liking this no color, which is kind of like a peach. And it's by the brand Sech Vite, and I like that it's a cruelty-free brand. So I'm going to leave this and all the makeup products in the description box. So as an eyeshadow, I'm going to be using this stick by elf and so on one side it has the shadow stick and on the other side it has an eyeliner and i really like this shade it's like a gold color so i just apply it on my Ooh. <gasps> what happened <laughs> oh no okay <laughs> right there so basically i just apply it on my eyelid and with a brush i just going to Blend that in. And now I'm going to use the other side of the stick. And it's basically like a brown bronzy color. So yesterday my boyfriend, he thought about going to get gas for his car around midnight. So... He went like at 1 a.m. and he came back home until like 2.30 and yeah there was a lot there was a long line we lived by Coral Gables and no gas station nearby had gas the colors on this stick are subtle but I really like it for everyday use so now I'm gonna do the tight eyeliner I'm gonna try to see myself through here it's kind of hard so I had to apply the eyeliner in the bathroom I couldn't see myself through this but the one that I'm using is this one the color it's kind of fading away from 
the crayon but I'm going to look it up and I'm going to add it in the description box so for my eyebrows if you have been following me you know that I always do it with a stencil because for me it's so much easier and faster so for a long time I used the brown shade but now I really like the black one so a lot of people have been buying flights to leave Florida and other people are leaving by car and they are going out of state and I'm here and we have some family members that are here as well I like doing this process because they come out the same and it's quick and my eyebrows are done and then I just brush it a little so when I'm done I'm gonna show you guys outside in the pool and how the weather is looking now <laughs> So almost done, I'm gonna apply mascara and this is by the brand Pacifica. So I used to have longer lashes and I used to have more hairs, but I bought the lashes that come in a kit and you can apply them yourself with a glue, but it made a lot of my eyelashes to fall and yeah, now my little hairs are growing back. So now I'm going to be heading to the supermarket and see what else I can find because a lot of places are closing today. So I'm not going to straighten my hair. I just want it natural the way it is. So I'm just going to apply like a lotion, like cream to my hair. Okay, for my hair, I'm going to be using two things. I have this one, Moa, which is a leave-in conditioner, and it smells amazing. It has argan oil, omega-3, melaleuca oil, and so it helps to give your hair shine. And the other one that I'm going to be applying is this Milk by She Moisture, and I just love how it smells, and I like that it makes my hair look healthy, and it gives it shine. Let's shake it up. So I just apply a little on top and also on the ends. And now the lotion. So that's it for my makeup and now I'm just going to apply a hair clip that kind of matches the earrings and I just apply it on the side and that's it. <laughs> <laughs> So now we are heading outside and I'm going to show you how it looks. As you can tell, it's a sunny and beautiful day. So that's it for today. I'm, I'm going to be heading out and see what I can find. And I'm just going to maintain myself calm and not fight over things. There are a lot of people fighting out there for the leftover things, but we just need to hope for the best and that everything will be fine. Just please keep us in your prayers and pray for all the people that have been affected already and so if you like this video don't forget to give it a thumbs up you can leave me a comment and i'll see you guys in the next video kisses bye